Kvällens sista program kommer att gå i musikens tecken. Och i den lilla studion i New York samlas både unga och gamla stjärnor. Starring Jules Holland, David Sanborn, and the Sunday Night Band. Tonight's guests, Dr. John, Mavis Staples, and Jeff Keeley. no time for applause. Welcome to Sunday night. My name is Jules Holland. I'm rushing a bit because we've got a lot of music tonight and very, very little time. You'll be hearing uh, Dr. John, the night tripper, New Orleans Groove King and generally good egg. Jeff Healy, shining new talent on the guitar, playing literally like no other man on earth. And the superb Mavis Staples, the gospel singer, soul singer, with an extraordinarily sumptuous voice. Our next guest, uh, Dr. John, is from New Orleans, as uh, some of you know, and uh, New Orleans is uh, very famous for Mardi Gras, and one of the highlights of Mardi Gras is uh, when the various Indian groups uh, get together and dress in very colorful costumes and perform and march down the streets. Uh, uh, and uh, I, I have three questions for you, do uh, Doctor. Uh, are those uh, traditional songs that they sing, and uh, do they make the, use the same songs every year, and are you a real doctor? Well, those are very traditional songs they sing, and they sing them every year when they feel like it. Uh -huh. And for example, <laughs> well, they do like song like I go, I go, which which means I go, we come, we gonna have some fun. So we could conjugate you, the uh, the if verb you don't I get go. Out the way we gonna step over you. Uh, well, <laughs> so it's a kind of a warning, kind of a warning. You get out of the way. It's or, definitely. Uh, because everybody going to conjugate in the middle of the issue. I see. Okay, well, maybe we should conjugate in the middle of this issue and do ICO. Yeah. <laughs> Disengage. 
Dancing, go go dancing in my little sort of booth. All right, right Jules. Ex extraordinary. Our next guest, ladies and gentlemen, yeah. some people would spend a million dollars and you wouldn't move, you wouldn't be moved at all. This next guest just has to sing a note and the hairs on the back of your neck will stand up. <laughs> ladies, and, ladies and gentlemen, please a big hand for Mavis Staples. <laughs> Let me walk you over I'll give you a for security reasons. <laughs> Maybe and David will help Maybe. me. Maybe. Hey. Hey. All right. Well, there's the mic. Here's the band. And Fellas, we do a little house and out of home. All right. Is that all right? <laughs> you lay it down, we'll pick it up. Okay. Oh, yes. A chair is still a chair. Even when there's no one sitting there But a chair is not a house And a house is not a home When there's no one there To hold you tight And no one you can kiss Good night A room is still a room Even when there's nothing there but gloom But a room is not a house And a house is not a home When the two of us are far apart And one of us One mistake 
keep us apart. Oh no. And turn the key, darling. Please be there. Still in love with you. I'm not meant to live alone. Turn my house into a home. Every time I climb the stairs. Won't you please be there, still in love with me? Still in love with me? Still in love, still in love, still in love, so in love. Bonjour. Well, you may, may remember a little bit earlier we said we had lots of music for you and very little time. Well, Jules, uh, that's not exactly true anymore. Somebody screwed up and uh, now we've got a few minutes to kill. Well, I, I'm not going to apologise for this. It seems lately I've been apologising too much, even for somebody whose catchphrase is, after all, I can't <laughs> apologise enough. I haven't been using it this week. So, rather than dwell on our shortcomings of the show, which we could easily do, but we shan't, uh, let's for once think about its benefits. In fact, we'd like to show you some of the many reasons a person like yourself might care to watch this programme. That's right, and we hope that it's informative. And we're fairly certain that uh, this will use the, the time up that we've got left over. Most so, likely. Just uh, if you'd like to watch the monitors in here. I think that, um, as well as those sort of reasons, there are, there are the more important reasons of the sort of calibre, which is very large indeed, of guest that we have on there. Well, absolutely, and, and our next guest is an example of that. Our next guest has a, a very unusual way of playing the guitar, and, uh, well, as you may notice, he's got the guitar across his knees and he's sitting down. And, uh, as you may not know, he uses all five of his, what normally would be fret fingers, uh, to... Uh, play different kinds of vibrato, and he does a lot of bending with his thumb, and I'm talking about him like he's not here, right? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is a very unique musician, Mr. Jeff Healy, and uh, he's going to play a song called See the Light. Jeff?
Enchanting duet, never ever done before. These two people have never performed before. Dr. John and Mavis Staples will now do Don't Let the Sun Catch You Crying. Woman, don't you say no crocodile tears. I'll never take you back in a million years. Don't let the sun Catch you crying, crying at my front door. You done mama dirty. She sure don't want you no more. Oh no, no, no. 
biggest fan of, of, uh, of Max Payne. Uh, as have I. You know. Well, Mac, you've been, like, you've been in a lot of interesting places, uh, musical and otherwise. Uh, uh, and in fact, I heard a story about you and Ronnie Barron being in a, in a, in a place one time that it, it kind of, uh, well, I guess you could say it made, the, made you the piano player you are today. And is, that, is there any truth in that? Uh, yeah, that's true. I got uh, winged in the finger in a little motel yeah, incident. Down winged in the finger? Uh, well, uh, <laughs> pow. Uh, Shooter. With, with a, yeah, you got it. A gun. That's right. That's and uh, it kind of changed from a guitarist to a pianski that I try to be in these days. And <laughs> that's a kind of instant career decision. Yeah, you know. Yeah. And that's great, you see, because, I, I mean, I've always admired your piano playing very much, and, and I've got a, got a bit of a background in piano, but it was just, you know, I had lessons when I was a little child. There nobody, was no gun no, play Nobody involved. shot me or anything, you know. Maybe that's why I'm not, I'm not, I'm not up to your standard, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think that's, that, that was probably an example of someone being in the right place at the, the wrong time, which you is... Better, yeah. <laughs>
Sunday night is being brought to you on a pay-per-view basis. If you are watching this show, send $475 to Sunday Night Party Fund, 1619 Broadway, Suite 607, New York, New York, 10019. During the 1930s and 40s, uh, the great pianists uh, Pete Johnson and Albert Ammons would dress in identical clothing and play boogie-woogie duets. Uh, unfortunately, these giants of the piano have passed away, and this extraordinary spectacle has not been seen for many, many years. Uh, the precise fingering and split-second timing required uh, make this one of the most demanding and dangerous pieces of music to perform. And only a handful of people left on Earth possess both the skill and the courage to attempt this almost extinct art form. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Sunday night's own Boogie Woogie Twins. Yeah. Gentlemen. for our fantastic guest this evening, Dr. John. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Mavis Staples. Superb. Yeah. Jeff Healy, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. And, and of course, the, the Boogie Woogie Twins. The Boogie Woogie, the Ambassadors of Love. Beautiful. Yeah. Well, uh, how did we do after time after all that? Was there enough time to fill in a, a, the entire show? Well, well, we just missed it by about three minutes. Uh, I think the, the reason to watch the show piece uh, came up a little bit short. Uh, so if you're watching us on tape, go back and look at those commercials you missed there. Very good, very artistic, yet another reason to watch the show. Yeah, there you are. Thank you all of our guests then. And I managed to get in a costume change. I think that was important. Oh. And I think um, <laughs> maybe it's all to take us somewhere. Well, why don't you take us there, Mavis? I'll, I'll take okay. us there. Okay, all right. I'll take you there. I'll take you there. I'll take you there. Ah.
Yeah. 